It appears Diddy is facing a relentless string of lawsuits with recent allegations mounting against him. One of the latest lawsuits by various individuals accuses him of assault and reportedly orchestrating situations where the plaintiff was compelled to engage in unwanted intimate acts with his associates. These legal battles seem to have taken a toll on his finances, as rumors suggest he's selling assets like his LA mansion. Each update on Diddy seems to bring more bad news, from legal troubles to ongoing controversies and upcoming documentaries exploring his past actions. Additionally, federal authorities are reportedly considering bringing him before a grand jury for potential charges. The federal investigation into Diddy's alleged actions is progressing despite many of the cases being beyond the statute of limitations, which typically prevents criminal charges for incidents dating back to the early 90s. Federal authorities argue that these circumstances warrant an exception aiming to convene a grand jury gather testimony from witnesses against Diddy. If indicted, he would face trial with incriminating evidence such as a reported video showing him engaging physically with Cassie, complicating matters further. CNN reports that federal investigators are preparing to present accusers before a grand jury in New York City. Potential witnesses mentioned include Diddy's ex-girlfriend Young Miami, alleged stalker Daphne Joy, Cassie, former bodyguard Gene Deal, and others associated with him. Meanwhile, amidst these legal proceedings, another woman has stepped forward, accusing Diddy of assault and coerced acts, echoing allegations previously made in a lawsuit by Lil Rod. These developments continue to paint a challenging picture for Diddy as the legal process unfolds. Adria English, a former adult star, has filed a lawsuit alleging that she was coerced into sexual acts at parties hosted by Diddy over decades. She claims the incidents began in 2004 during a Sean John modeling edition. According to her, Diddy allegedly demanded intimate acts from models for job opportunities echoing similar claims made by others against him. These accusations add to the legal challenges Diddy is currently facing. Adria English claims to have been encouraged to consume alcohol, fight with drugs like ecstasy, and to flirt with guests, although initially not engaging in intercourse. Over time, she alleges Diddy groomed her into a pattern of exploitation culminating in him allegedly coercing her to have sex with Jacob Arabo, known as Jacob the Jeweler. She asserts she was paid extra for this and claims that he congratulated her, later allegedly attempting to involve her with other men at his parties, where she says she was assaulted. Adria further alleges that he promised career advancement in exchange for compliance, later retaliating against her she tried to leave by blackmailing her by blackballing her and her boyfriend from the industry. Diddy's lawyers deny these allegations, emphasizing his confidence in prevailing against what they call baseless claims, despite multiple lawsuits against him alleging similar misconduct. Diddy and his legal team initially denied Cassie's accusations of physical violence portraying her as a vindictive ex seeking financial gain, undermining a fellow black man. However, their narrative shifted when a video surfaced showing Diddy's altercation with Cassie at a Los Angeles hotel in March 2016, aligning with details in her subsequent lawsuit. Forced to confront the evidence, Diddy admitted to his past actions, acknowledging them as inexcusable and expressing remorse. He claimed to have undergone therapy and sought spiritual guidance, describing a transformation from the person he was at that time. This incident marked a public reckoning for Diddy amid ongoing legal challenges and allegations against him. Diddy's substantial legal expenses have reportedly strained his finances, with recent payouts totaling millions in ongoing costs for his legal defense. Reports indicate he's facing financial strain, 
prompting him to put his $40 million Los Angeles mansion on the market for $70 million. This move is seen as desperate in an attempt to generate cash flow as maintaining his high profile legal team comes at a steep cost. The pressure to cover these expenses has led to speculation about his financial stability. Compounded by previous issues such as a homeland security raid on his property, fans have been vocal, likening Diddy's accumulation of lawsuits to collecting infinity stones, seemingly endless. Accusations against him span a wide range, alleging involvement in various serious incidents. Claims include destroying Kid Cudi's car, aging in underground, underage orgies with older women, perpetrating abuse, breaking Kim Porter's nose on a yacht, artist exploitation, and withholding collaboration opportunities from artists like Lil' Kim with Michael Jackson. These allegations coupled with his perceived power and influence have fueled strong public opinion, suggesting a belief in almost any accusation against him. Let us know your thoughts in the comments. Stay tuned, hit the like button, and subscribe to our channel.